In this project, you will learn how to create this flat looking office, uh, office space. And there's quite a lot going on uh, here. I mean, there's quite a lot of uh, elements to be created. And uh, usually, uh, when, I, uh, when I design things like that, I start with the most prominent um, pieces uh, in the design. So in this case, I guess I would start, well, usually I would start with the, with the computer, with the lamp, maybe the speakers. But I thought that in this case, uh, well, in the case of this, uh, this design, we could take a, a different approach. So instead of just creating uh, these elements, I think we should start, well, we could start with the, with the background. So first we are going to create this wallpaper, um, then we are going to create the shelf, and we are going to put some paint on the wall down here, and we are going to create the table with the shading. And after that we are going to put some things on the wall. So we are going to start with the window, and we're going to create the clouds, the reflections, of course, the window itself. Then we are going to create the picture, and maybe let me just zoom in a bit. And we are going to create the nail, uh, the cord, and of course the frame itself. And uh, as you can see, I, I've put um, this uh, deserted island, uh, this, uh, this deserted island uh, design uh, we uh, we created in in another project. And after that, we are going to create the clock. And the clock is uh, is a real uh, real flat design. It's, it actually looks uh, very very um, Scandinavian. I guess I could say it's it's really minimal. So we are going to create that. Then we are going to move on to the folders, and we are going to put them on the shelf. We are going to create um, the red, uh, the green, and the blue folder right here. And after that, I guess we are going to move to well to the table. We are going to start putting things on the table. Uh, but before that, I just noticed that we still need to put the flower on our uh, on our uh, well shelf uh, underneath um, the window. And to tell you the truth, we are going to have a lot of fun with creating the flower. We are going to learn some some really nice techniques to create uh, the, this kind of flat looking flower. So that's next. And after that, we are going to really move to the table. So we are going to create the lamp, and we are going to use some pen tools, some transformations, some some ellipse. Well, well, an ellipse tool. We are going to create some ellipses. And after that, we are going to create the speakers. And if you think that they look a bit like the Logitech computer speakers, well, you are right, because they were my inspiration. I just think they, they look really original and they, uh, and they go really well, well with, this, with this whole design concept. So after that, we are going to create the computer. So we are going to create, um, well, the monitor and the stand, the base, and of course we are going to add some some content here on the screen. So it just you know it doesn't look that sad and so plain. And after that, we are going to create the mug that you can see right here. We are going to create the steam as well, and we are going to finish the design with the Wi-Fi router down uh, down here. So all in all, quite a lot to cover, but I think that, that um, in the process you'll learn some really nice techniques and I think that creating this kind of designs is really um, a good incentive to learn uh, real, um, different techniques to create flat design, flat design uh, pieces of artwork. And one more thing before we actually start uh, creating uh, our, um, our elements. I got a lot of a lot of swatches, color swatches, color groups in my swatches panel, so I am going to be referring to them quite a lot. And of course, you don't have to use the same color swatches that I went for. Uh, you can use your own color swatches, but just remember to remain inside the flat design color uh, color schemes. So okay, now that we know what we are going to cover in this uh, in this project, let's actually start designing. So in the next video, we are going to create uh, we are going to create the background. Let me just show it to you one more time. We are going to create the background. We are going to use some uh, some some path um, path uh, dividing here with the wallpaper and some well some simple rectangles here with the shelf and the table. So if it's something that you're interested in, keep watching.